Hey guys, so today I decided I'm going to take a break from the hustle and bustle of finals week and preparing to graduate and all that crazy stuff that's going on in my life right now. I haven't mentioned that I'm really stressed out. Uh, yeah, so I decided that today I wanted to film a video because so much stuff came out today about the After movie, which many of you guys probably know, especially if you're watching this video, the book After or the series by Anna Todd is becoming a movie. And this has been in the works for a while now, but today we finally finally have our two main characters casted, which is super exciting. So I'm going to be talking about that and some other stuff that has to do with the movie in today's video. I decided that I'm going to kind of do a few of these videos, maybe when some more of the cast comes out, when filming starts, I'm not really sure. But I love doing videos like this, and I know that a lot of you guys are fans of the After series. My book talk on After is like one of my most popular videos on my channel. So. I know that plenty of you guys are excited about the after movie and interested in hearing my thoughts on it. I was talking to a lot of you guys on Twitter today about the castings and we were having some great conversations. So I'm excited to bring it to the video and I have a lot that I want to say. It's actually so crazy to me because I read after forever ago. Like I was reading it when it was a fan fiction and it wasn't Harden, it was Harry. Um, and that was forever ago. It was when I was in high school and now I'm like a junior in college almost. So it's really crazy to me. Me and my friend were texting today, reminiscing on the days when we would literally be like texting each other during class. Like did Anna post a new chapter? Like is the new chapter out? And then like sneakily be reading it during biology class, like the new after chapters. Like that's how obsessed we were. And it was so crazy to like reminisce on that. And it's especially weird that this casting just came out because last week I just randomly decided to pick up after and start rereading it and now I'm rereading the second book like I finished the first one rereading the second one honestly like I start rereading after and then all this stuff comes out about the movie like I think I did it so you're welcome um <laughs> but I'm really excited to talk the cast so I'm gonna get into that I'm sure you guys have already seen who's playing Hardin and Tessa but obviously I'm going to tell you Hardin is played by Hero Finez Tiffin. I'm not sure if that's how you pronounce his name. I hope it is. Um, so Hero. He is an actor. He's from England. He's 20 years old. And he was in Harry Potter as young Voldemort, which I didn't know. I didn't recognize him from that. But when I was texting that same friend I was talking about earlier, she seemed to be really excited about it because she remembered that she had a crush on him when she was little and she was like freaking out that he's going to play Harden. I, on the other hand, was just kind of like, okay, like I don't really know much about him. The picture that Anna posted, which I'll have on the screen, obviously, I looked at it and I was kind of like, okay, immediately I saw him as more of a Zed character. And I don't know why. I just didn't I don't know. After so many years of picturing Harry Styles as Harden and then eventually picturing Daniel Sharman, who was my original pick for Harden, um, it's just weird to see him because he looks very different. Like Daniel Sharman looks a lot like Harry Styles, but Hero doesn't look like either of them. But I don't think that's a bad thing and I don't think that he's unattractive or won't be fit for the role. Truly, I need to see what he looks like as Harden. In the picture that Anna posted, he has like a buzz cut and you can't really tell how he's gonna be for the part. With piercings maybe, I don't know if they're doing that for the movie and everything, but you can't really judge it yet because it's not him, it's not Harden, it's Hero. So I feel like we'll be okay. I'm not too upset that it's not Daniel Sharman, which I don't think any of us can be to blame for the fact that it's not Daniel Sharman because According to a producer of the movie, Daniel Sharman turned down the role. I guess he was offered the role to play Harden and he turned it down, which is really disappointing. I know so many people really, really wanted him to play Harden, myself included. But you know, it's fine. We have Hero. I'm not mad at it. I feel like he'll be really good. I'm glad that he's actually British. I'm glad that he's actually 20 years old. Um, and I think, I think he'll do the part justice. I don't really know how he is with acting. I've never seen anything that he's in. So I'm just putting my trust in the fact that the directors and the producers and the casting people are doing all of their research and know what they're getting themselves into. I'm sure they are. So I'm fine with Hero. I think he's going to be great. And I'm really excited to see what he brings to the role of Harden. Okay, so now, Tessa, we have Julia Goldani Tellis, who is another actress that I've never heard of. Obviously, the person that everybody has pictured as Tessa is Indiana Evans, who everyone just always pictured her as Tessa. Even back in the fanfic days, that was the girl that everyone pictured Tessa as. So, seeing this girl with really dark hair on Anna's Instagram today, I was a little bit nervous, but then I'm kind of like, okay, hair dye. And she does have that kind of similar look. Um, 
I think she'll be fine as Tessa. I saw some edits today of her with blonde hair and they actually look pretty good. I'm sure she's gonna dye her hair for the part. If she doesn't, I guess we'll just deal with it. But I honestly have faith in her. I don't think she's gonna be an issue for me. I'm excited. I'm just really excited that they casted both of them. And they're both relatively around college age. I think she's 22. So not bad. I'm excited. I don't know. We'll see. It would have honestly been a miracle if they had actually gotten Daniel Sharman and Indiana Evans to be the characters. So the fact that they didn't, but they still did a good job with the casting and that I think that they both are going to fit their characters well, that's good. I'm really excited now to see all of the other characters get casted. So when that starts coming out, I will definitely make more videos so we can talk about that as well. I want to hear all of your opinions on the casting for Tessa and Harden down below. Let me know what you think of Hero and Julia. I asked you guys if there was anything specific you wanted me to cover in this video other than the casting. And a lot of you guys just wanted me to talk about general expectations for the movie, what I think about it, what I think it's going to be like. And honestly, I'm just really excited to see anything. I was reading an interview from Anna um, where she said that the ending is going to be kind of different and it's gonna kind of take some of book two and bring it to the first movie, but she thinks it all flows really well, so I'm really excited to see how that goes. The first book is obviously very long, and I do think that there's a lot of things that could be cut out and it won't really matter, so I'm not too worried about formatting. I just hope it keeps, like, the general story the same, and I hope that all of my favorite parts are included. I don't really know. I'm just excited to see anything at this point. I feel like I've been waiting for this movie to come out since I was 15. Um, so I'm really, really excited. Another thing that I read online today is that they start filming next month, which is really exciting. I'm glad that production is rolling and that we'll actually end up getting a movie probably sometime next year, hopefully. But I heard that they're actually gonna be filming the movie in Boston, which hello, like that's where I'm from. Uh, but I don't understand why because the movie or the book is supposed to be set in Seattle So I don't know if they're just filming it here and they're gonna pretend like it's Seattle or what the deal with that is But I guess they're filming it here part two of this video me vlogging in downtown Boston looking for the actors Oh my god, oh, I'm not that crazy. I promise I won't do that, but it's kind of exciting that they're filming in my city. That's kind of fun But I'm just kind of confused about it because Boston and Seattle pretty different. I don't know but I am very happy that they're at least starting to film next month. That's promising. And I'm glad that we'll start to see some pictures, hopefully, of them in character. So we'll be able to talk about that a little bit, probably starting next month. I really, really hope everything goes well and that the movie comes out good and the acting is good. And I'm just, I'm really excited for really any final product that we'll get at this point. But there's just a lot happening. I'm really excited that the casting was announced. I feel like I'm 15 again. It's so crazy. Like, I feel like I've just been bounced back into this universe where all I cared about was after um, in One Direction. And it's like so funny to me, especially because I'm rereading after right now. Like, I wouldn't have been this excited about the movie casting unless I was rereading the book right now. So it's really exciting for me. I really can't wait to hear all of the updates and the news going around with this movie. If you want to see more videos from me fangirling with you, you know, one fangirl to another, we can definitely make that happen. So let me know in a comment down below if you like this type of video of me just rambling my thoughts about the film. I'll definitely do more for you guys if you're interested. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Again, leave me all of your thoughts in the comments. I want to hear anything and everything that you have to say about the after film or the book or whatever you want to say. Definitely leave me a comment. Um, other than that, I know that I've been slacking on the YouTube game. I have so many books to haul. So look out for a book haul coming very, very soon. If you guys want an update on my life, just because my life is crazy right now, let me know. I literally graduate next week with my associate's degree. I'm transferring to a new college in the fall. I just signed a lease on my apartment. So much is going on. I'm really excited. If you want to see apartment videos, college videos, advice videos, like everything. I got you. This summer videos, you and me all the time. I'm really excited. Um, but thank you guys so much for watching this video. I'm such a weirdo and I'll talk to you next time. Bye!